Hello everybody, today we'll see Google Cloud's uh, IAM service. IAM stands for Identity and Access Management. This is one of the service which Google offers. Basically, this service helps you to manage the access control by defining uh, the authentication and the authorization, who and, uh, and the access. In uh, GCP term, it's the identity and role. So, so identity part, how we authenticate is using Google's account, service account, or G Suite account. The roles are basically how to, what is the, the role to control the, the, uh, the resource like a compute engine or storage bucket. Let's go see the hierarchy. This is the hierarchy. It starts at the organization level, folder, project, and the resource. This is a nice diagram. Yeah, let's see that. Okay, this is a nice diagram. So where it defines the organization, folder, the projects, different projects, and the resource. So what we'll see is this important line which tells Child policy cannot restrict access granted at a higher level. For example, if the user has been granted an editor role at a project level, that is at this level, if the user is having editor role and another access has been provided, which is a view role, for a child resource. Child resource could be, for example, DCP cloud storage. Here, there is a view access. So, as you guess, this user will have editor access for the child resource also. So, let's see this in demo. Let's switch to the console. This is my console. So, let's go to the IM and admin part. So to demonstrate this capability, what we'll do is we'll add a, a Gmail account. In this case, I'll add my dad's account. First role is add the project, give editor, add one more role. So which is, let's take in this case, the storage. At the storage, we'll give viewer. So editor at the project level and viewer at the resource level. So that's what it mentioned, editor and viewer at the child resource. Click save. Policy has been addressed. Now let's switch the account. So it's loaded and we can see we can go to compute engine, start, stop, because this user is a reader, uh, editor, sorry. So we can start, delete all those stuffs. Let's go to the storage. We can see the two buckets all good now what we'll do is close this window now we'll just remove the editor access and just have storage viewer let's delete it please don't check this this will remove the entire account now it's only storage viewer now what we'll do is let's switch to my dad's account Screen is loaded. Let's go to storage because the, the access is only view. Viewer, we will see this message fail to load. Uh, 
so what we can do is click on the cloud shell and we will be able to view it in the cloud shell let's do this we see if we are able to list it and we will be able to go inside and view the other documents there so so that's the explanation of this sentence uh, hope you enjoyed it thanks a lot for watching have a great day